Everybody loves big, beautiful images. Even on our camera, a big LCD can help us with image review, filming, controls, and more. But there's a limit to how big an onboard LCD can be. Manfrotto has an answer, and it's called the Digital Director. Hi, I'm Larry Becker. The Manfrotto Digital Director is a tethering system that connects Nikon and Canon DSLRs to an iPad. Now, in this case, it's an iPad Air 2 using an Apple-certified iPad frame holder that incorporates an ARM Cortex A8 600 MHz microprocessor. The software side of the Digital Director is an app for the iPad that displays high-resolution live feed images and gives you comprehensive control over camera settings for both still and video capture. That live feed image alone is enough reason for a lot of folks to pick up one of these. Focusing during video on a small LCD has always been a challenge. The system comes with a cable that's just over three feet, but it can work with good quality cables that are up to 10 times as long. It can run on four AA batteries or you can plug into AC power. The back of the iPad holder has a 3816 brass fitting for compatibility with all sorts of support options. There are four cold shoe mounts on the back so that you can attach other accessories. And I really appreciate that the frame is user replaceable, so your digital director will be forward compatible with future iPads. Everything else I want to cover is part of the user experience, so let's plug in a camera and see what we can do. Right up front, you can see that the live image is bright and sharp thanks to the iPad's high quality display. I've used some remote control apps and wireless remote control systems in the past, and one of the frustrating things is that some cameras only send five or seven frames a second to the iPad, and that's not a true live feed. With the cable connection, the onboard processor, and the iOS app, this live feed is a true real-time display. The app itself is loaded with controls, including live touch focus, which lets you touch on screen where you want to focus. Keep in mind, even if your Nikon or Canon doesn't have a touch screen for touch focus, it does now. The same goes for focus magnification and focus peaking, two tools that are especially helpful with manual focusing, with video or still shooting. And speaking of controls that aren't available remotely, some cameras can't start recording video remotely. With the digital director, they can. Other things that you can control include aperture, shutter speed, exposure compensation, white balance, color temperature, the shutter button, and whether you're shooting single or continuous. You can see mic levels and histograms on screen. You can even control the controls. In other words, you can move controls and readouts around on the iPad app to set up your view how you'd like and you can throw away any control panels that you're not using. Once you capture images, you can download full-size JPEGs to the iPad and make minor edits, including exposure, contrast, and lightness. You can crop and rotate the image. You can check the EXIF data and histograms, and of course, you can share those images from your camera roll using email or FTP. For still shots and video, if you think an extra-large, super-sharp, Highly controllable remote screen sounds like a good idea. Pick up a Manfrotto Digital Director and see for yourself. That's a first look at the Manfrotto Digital Director. Thanks for watching. Whether you're a hobbyist or a professional, BNH has the answers to your questions. Experience a world of technology at our New York City Superstore. Connect with us online or give us a call. Our staff of experts is happy to help.